everyone. Thanks for tuning into Sims Workshop. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Today we're going to be unboxing my Owl Crate. I love Owl Crate. I really do think that Owl Crate has just been upping their game a lot. But you know, not just Owl Crate. A lot of publishers, they see, they listen. We want pretty books. Like, I don't know. There's nothing else I can say about that. We like pretty books. And we cannot lie. All you other readers can't deny. And you know what also makes me very happy? They put their spoiler sheet on the top. They put it on the top of the box. So that way, when I do something like this, I know what the hell I'm grabbing. First up, my Perfect Pairings Collection Limited Edition Pin, Percy Jackson and Little Bands. This is number 5 of 12. This is made by Say Your Art. I, I quite love, I love Percy Jackson. I bought the bookish box ones. I mean, they're freaking gorgeous. Ooh. Percy and Annabeth. Look at that. Ta-da. That's so cool. I love these pins so much. They all go in my bag. And by the end of the year, my, my bag is going to be like really heavy. Just like it was last year. So yes, one more time for you guys. Um, my perfect Paris pin featuring Percy and Annabeth. Okay, next up we've got, ooh, another ceramic trivet by N1 Art, <gasps> inspired by Darth the Moon Goddess. I love that book so much. <sighs> I use these, by the way. I love useful things. My husband's like, where are you going to put this one? I'm like, in the drawer with the others. He's like, I don't think there's enough room. Although this one might be too pretty. I think I'll just buy a stand for it and put it in my bookcase. Oh my god. Look at that. That's so gorgeous. Oh, I love it. Love it. Love it. I, I do use these. I do. Like I said, my husband constantly says, where are you going to put it? Well, I, I, I find. Uh, let's see. The red, this red London pen inspired by Dr. Shade of Magic features artwork artwork lovingly illustrated by legion of potatoes Let's see if i can get this out oh oh look at that so let's see if we can see all the illustrations i gotta read this series do i own it yes i bought it why because you know what the invisible life of Eddie larue was such a phenomenal and amazing book i need to read everything by v.e schwab now everything Everything. You know when a book just gets you and you're just like, now I need everything by this author? That is me. With the e. Schwab. Great pen. Let's look at the packaging. Alright, now we've got a big box here. Um, ooh, look inside this mirror and see beyond the invisible boundary between the human and the fairy lane, inspired by the buried and the bound. Our mirror is a magical piece. <gasps> Designed by the Pearls Reader. I'm saying her Instagram handle because I know I'm going to butcher her name. Or their name. I'll remind you. Oh my, oh my goodness. Look at that. It's double-sided. Oh my god. That is cool. Every, oh my god. That's so cool. It's backwards. It's, sorry. I got like, OMG. Wait a second. No, it wasn't backwards just a second ago because I read it. Oh my god. Oh, everything, absolutely everything has a price. Oh my god, that's so cool. Sorry. I'm, I'm like fangirling now. I like this. I like this a lot. That is so stinking cool. Okay. And now... Oh, this is cute. 
Okay, let's see. Uh, trivet, Death Mirror, Lord. Okay, so this is a um, metal bag tag inspired by Lord of the Rings. I don't know if that wasn't obvious. Um, by Teresa Chen, also known as Divine Literary. Okay, this is the last item and then it's the book. This is cool. Oh, oh. Very cool. Okay, so this, it just, the paper just flew out where it has my name and address and stuff. That's cool. I like it. I like it a lot. It wouldn't have fallen out if I had put the wire in, but it's okay. I'll get it after I finish recording. OMG. You know what's funny? I actually already bought this book at Barnes & Noble because they had a Barnes & Noble exclusive edition. Uh, so much for not having duplicates. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. Oh my god, this is so pretty. I love this rolled gold. This rose gold. <gasps> okay. And you know what? I'm pretty sure that Fairy Loot is going to do a copy too because they did um, their other series. <sighs> so I'm going to end up having three copies of this book, aren't I? It's okay. You can never have too many books. Now my kids won't have to, you know, fight over books when they get older. Be like, well, I'm gonna read this edition. I'm gonna read this one. Yeah, I'm just, I'm being hopeful. <laughs> All right, let's, let's show it off, shall we? All right, Song of the Six Realms. First of all, I love this cover. I love these edges and I love this dust jacket. It's absolutely gorgeous. This jacket is reversible, so taking all that detailing. And now, boiling on the front, boiling on the back, and we've got gorgeous end pages. Different front and back. Man, that kiss looks. Ooh. Ooh. And it is signed by the author. Okay, so where did I just put my cheat sheet? Right here. So, all right. Song of Six Realms. The signed edition features a gorgeous redesigned cover by Dan Lin Zhang. Don't worry. There will be links in the description below to all the artists and all the contributors. As well as rose gold gilded edges. Turn over the cover for the reversible dust jacket with gorgeous artwork by Dri Gomez. On the hardback we have some magnificent foil designs by Azura Arts. Inside you'll find gorgeous end pages done by Jessica Liu. Finally a ribbon bookmark as well as an author letter and bonus content. So, let's see what the bonus content is. Oh, that's so cute! It's an annotated chapter with handwritten annotations by the author. If I can show them to you real quick. Look at that. That's so cute. She's doing that little drawings right there. I love it. So cute. And I mean, a ribbon bark bookmark is a ribbon bookmark. You don't need to really see that. But in any case, thank you all for tuning into this unboxing of my. What month was this? May. My young adult um, May Owl Crate. Absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely a fan. I love Owl Crate. I cannot help but, you know, speak praises about it. Um, so, in any case, again, thank you for tuning in. Please don't forget to like, subscribe, and share with all your book loving friends. I hope you all have a wonderful rest of your day. And as always, happy reading.